Hi, I'm Noah. Noah Mez, speaking from Ghana West Africa Missions. Uh, we really appreciated the support you are giving to missions in Ghana, West Africa. We really, really appreciated that. And because of the money, a lot of people are now turning to Jesus Christ. We were able to preach the word, share the good news with every family, including those in the remotest parts of the Ghana. We thank you for the support through Mr. Missions, everybody is being preached the word here. Even though you are not here, buy your money, send the preachers to the remotest part of their country. We thank you and God really bless you. Amen. Noah Mins is a great servant of Jesus. I talk to him or email him several times a week. During 2009, Samuel and Noah and their team had brought 1,713 people, that's 1,713 souls to Jesus Christ. 559 people have been baptized in October alone. That included 433 individuals while we were in country and 126 baptized since we left. On Tuesday, we had 187 people give their life to Jesus. That is a record for the country of Ghana. People in Ghana are very hungry for the gospel. As we had Bible studies with those during our campaign, we found that they were very open to hearing what the Bible had to say. What the Bible says is very important. Many of them do not have a copy of the Bible so they can read for themselves. We try to provide every Christian with their own copy of the Bible. We saw much poverty while we were in Ghana during our campaign. It would break your heart to see people that need food, shelter, and many times clothing, but they're still happy. Nor is a great servant of the Lord. His pre-planning on where we would be made such a difference. This is our fifth campaign to Ghana. We learn something new each and every time we go. We had great results on Tuesday with 187 baptism. They knew that we were coming four to five months ahead of time. We had another village that we were supposed to get to that day, but we just ran out of time. So we went on Wednesday to that village. Since we didn't show up the day that they were all expecting, there was not near as many people there. We will know in the future that when we plan for one day to be at a village, we're going to be there on that day. We had a great team go to Ghana this year, and I'm very pleased that my wife went. Our team was 15 individuals, eight from the Phoenix area. We had David Lusk and Bob Howard from Dallas-Fort Worth. They were part of our, our initial team. Joel Coppinger and his wife Pat wanted to be a part of our team, and they invited uh, Stephen Black from California and Greg and Teresa Grounds from Hooker, Oklahoma. The team of 15 were nine days in country, and many souls were brought to Jesus because of their efforts. As we look to the future and our involvement with Ghana, we notice that we've only scraped the surface as far as the land mass. We've only been to parts of the central region, which is between Accra and Cape Coast. The Greenland Hotel is a great place to stay for our campaigns, but other people use it too. We had weddings going on while we were there. We had uh, CPA meetings uh, that we shared the restaurant with. It's just a great facility, and it's the best facility in this region. Here are several comments from some of the ladies. What I liked the most about the mission about our trip was the hundred and some baptisms we had in one day at the uh, ocean uh, village that we went to. The enthusiasm of all the workers was just unreal. It's hard to say what's the best thing about this trip because there are so many good things. I always enjoy teaching the Bible studies and seeing the people's faces when they finally get what Christianity is all about and then want to be baptized. Meeting um, my brothers and sisters in Africa was certainly a plus. Seeing so many souls added was definitely a plus. 
the energy that came from the group that we brought was very uplifting and friendships were made that will last for a lifetime. The hotel was a very nice facility. I was thankful every day to come home to a hard bed and a shower and a toilet and I'm thankful for that. The food was, um, was very good. The night with the garlic prawns was outstanding. The hotel people are very nice here at the hotel. Uh, the rooms are nice and clean. Uh, the food is fine. The hotel has, is beyond anything else you'd be find in Africa that I'm aware of. The beds are comfortable, they're clean. Flushing toilets are a plus and hot and cold running water. And having a refrigerator to keep the water in and the meds in is always something that I like. I was especially impressed with the team that we brought this year. The Coppinger team brought the team efforts to new heights that I've not experienced before. And to see the number of responses based on the number of workers we have has just been unreal. I would encourage anyone who ever has a desire to do mission work to hook up with Gary and others of the team because it's something that is personally rewarding in addition to increasing God's kingdom. I thank you a lot for supporting the Africa Ghana mission. We say hi in Africa. We say God bless you all. So light the fire.